Hello and welcome to Old Lady Plays. I'm Kate, the old lady, and there is construction going on in my apartment building, so I apologize for the odd random noises that various obnoxious people are making. It's been annoying for me all morning, so I invite you to imagine. Anyway, it hasn't been a lot of fun. Let's go to the game. Let's do some things. Now, I was going to come back a little later, but then I realized that Dundee were um, somebody we hadn't actually shown on screen before, and that I believe Hearts are next after that, and that's always fun to get my rival game in there. So, um, I thought we'd do Dundee and Hearts today, just as a sort of special surprise. I was going to go several, in, several more games into the future, but... I thought, no, why not? Let's get this one in and see how it goes. So today we're at home against Dundee. We are back to the usual crew of suspects. Woodman behind White, Hanlon, Ambrose, and Gray. Bridge behind McGinn, Ajaria, and McGarten as Magooch is still injured. And Slivka behind Murray. No big surprises anywhere in that list. I think we're ready to go. Let's do it. Hmm, carry straight on from where you finished. Let's see how we do. A little bit of response from that one, just a couple. Oh, that was interesting. Again, Slivka, all the way through to Murray, but he can't hold on to it with two men on him. Mazala tracking back. McGarten misses his tackle, so does the left back. Oh, but, oh, I was going to say the goalkeeper makes a brilliant save on the first one, and he certainly did, but Bianchi got the ball right back and uh, put it away this time. Shoot it where the guy with the gloves ain't. Oh, look at that. He went past the tackle to both of them. That was just bad. And then they didn't really close him down at all. Really disappointing. Great finish by Bianchi. Not to take anything away from him, but really we should have stopped that in several ways. Mm -hmm. Yep, pretty exciting first half. Mm -hmm. Yep. If I weren't sitting down, I'd do a little dance or something for you, and you know, just to pass the time because there isn't really much happening. Of course, we're in control of the match. We're at home, we're doing well. I'm not too worried about it. All we gotta do is put one in the net. And usually we're pretty good at that. So I'm gonna say, not that the performance was disappointing, that we've been unlucky. Because we've outplayed them in every way. And they've scored against the run of play. If you were to ask me what kind of manager I am, I would say that I'm really good at squad management, at, at sort of making sure that everybody gets their playing time, and that they're as fit as possible when they're doing it. And I'm fairly good at dynamics. I mean, I was fairly good at dynamics before it was called dynamics, um, in terms of treating the squad like real people and, and trying to... to you know, manage them in the same way that I would if they were my actual players. Um, so, it's I think it's uh, it's such an interesting game. It really is, for so many reasons. 
but uh, let's see what we can do with a couple of fresh pairs of legs out there. Should we risk Guidetti? Do 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 do. Sure, why not? On you go, kid. See what you can do. Should I give him the 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 Harry Redknapp talk? Does everybody know what the Harry Redknapp talk was? When he said to Mikhail or to what the hell was his name? Pavlichenko. I forget what his first name was. Pavlichenko, anyway. Um, just in run about a bit. Kick the ball. <laughs> so there you go. That's your instructions, Mr. Gudetti. Just in run about a bit and kick the ball. Go up to attacking. See if we can find our way through. My goodness, we are really struggling. Bridge takes the ball off him very nicely. Gudetti takes it down and around his man. Smith shoots from forever out and completely misses. Super duper job. Come on, I'm trying to now see it just the past time went past too fast. Ah we're gonna lose a game that we really ought to have won. They've done nothing in this game. Three half chances. We've outpossessed them, outshot them. Ay ay ay. Oh, that was just poor. That should be it. Yeah. Well, that was disappointing, wouldn't you say? I would say that was disappointing. I'm going to tell the team I think it was disappointing, too, and I'm even going to be assertive about it. Yeah, we should have been winning that match. There's no excuse for us losing. That's two games out of the blocks. That's not a good start. Especially look at Hearts. They've won both their first two. Hmm. That's not ideal. Alright. I am going to cut it here. And then I'll be back in a few moments with the other game. Oh, I didn't know my shirt was sparkling. Sometimes it does that. It needs a little more light. Anyway, it's not that important. It's tough to get the light right on the green screen with um, using natural light. It's just not easy. Um, but, you know, I do my best, and you know that, and really, it's all right. Anyway, I'll be back shortly. Hello, and ba welcome back. <coughs> Sorry about that. Um, we are back and ready for the next game. I'm running with exactly the same team. Um, slight changes on the subs bench, but otherwise exactly the same team. Woodman, White, Hanlon, Ambers, Gray, Bridge, behind McGinn, Ajaria, McGarten, Slivka, and Murray starting up front. Not a big surprise. Let's get to it. It's a big rivalry match today. We are off to... Tyne Castle, that's the name of it. Tyne Castle, there it is. Tyne Castle, Edinburgh. We're off to Tyne Castle for a local derby. Always the best kind. See, we were supposed to be favored on the outside, and now suddenly here we're a huge underdogs. I'm going to go with prove a point. Let's go. You guys are good. I know you're good. You know you're good. I always look forward to this one. As long as they can take care of their responsibilities, we're fine. If we perform as we know we can, we can get our result. Hmm. 
be a shame for the series if I managed to get myself sacked early on, wouldn't it? So let's hope that doesn't happen. And again, hangs one over, and it's in. F.A. Ambrose with the header. Nice and early. Straight off the bat, we're in. Back in with a goal. And just a simple straight header off the corner. Cannot argue with that. Bridge. Slivka Murray. Off the bar. Or the post, or possibly both. Free kick to them. And they've scored it. Walker. Running in from the top of the box. Well, there's a lot of them celebrating with him. He must be popular. So that's disappointing. Ajari has picked up a tight calf. Let's see if he can make it to half time. He's up and down and up and down. Looks like he's going to be okay to make it to half. And I'll change him then. Bridge. Can you play it back into somebody? Ajaria. Bridge. Ambrose. Ajaria. Slivka with the one touch pass and Murray with the finish. That was a great pass by Slivka, but what a finish by Murray. Right, where is it? Right here. There's a pass by Slivka. Right here. There. One touch. Murray takes a touch and then just fires it back across the goal. Beautifully taken goal. Two to one. We're out shooting them and everything. Perfect. Just the way you want things in a derby match. Uh, team talk. Doing well and your stuff is excellent and stuff and things like that. Don't be complacent. See, you like that. They like it like a belly rub on a cat. Makes them happy. Oh, I was going to take somebody off at halftime. Ejaria can come off from a gooch. The gooch is back after his injury layoff. Oops, missed the tackle there, but Ambrose is there with the header. Oh, there we go. Good hiding away. Slivka picks it up. Can he find somebody with it? No, he did, but his strength holds off some people, and he ends up with a corner from 30 meters out. That was crazy. And it's a nothing corner. Then we have a free kick. Big stop, and not enough. Hanlon gets the rebound. I don't know who got the first header. It's a pretty powerful header, though. Looks like Hanlon got the first header and then put away his own rebound. That's pretty good. Early in the second half to take the 3-1 lead. Doesn't look like we're necessarily over the game, though. Still, we are out shooting them in a rather impressive way. Murray. Magooch. McGarten. Scores! Wow, what a shot! And head move up to 6th position, which is not bad since we started the day in 11th. Murray. Back from Magooch. Out wide to the other, Mazala, and bang! Pick that one out. And 
headed away nicely, but not too far. Ooh, missed a tackle there, but backed up well. Murray's away. Two on two. Two on one. Two on none. Oh, what a save. Slivka does very well, but the goalkeeper does get down to it and stop it. Murray is having a pretty good game. And earns a free kick. I gotta say, I'm pretty pleased with how we're doing here. It certainly makes up for that wretched loss against Dundee. Let's see what we've got in the way of subs to make here. Anybody got a yellow card? You do have a yellow card, Mr. Br Gray. How about we bring on Mr. Brown? And... Yeah, I know. Nobody wants to be Mr. Pink. I tried letting everybody choose it. They all chose black. Uh, Slivka's had a good game, but I don't mind taking him out at this point. Actually, let's let's take him out. I'm going to leave that, and we'll see how it goes in a little bit. don't really have anybody to replace anybody else in the midfield, so I think Slivka will get the, the nod in terms of being pulled. Cammy Smith to see whether he can do something in this lovely 4-1 route. Murray is almost away. Is he almost? He skips the jaw. Oh, skips the tackle, takes the shot, but it's held up beautifully by, who is it in the net? Hanlon? Looked like his name was. I don't know who the goalie is for Heat, for Hearts, but I would call that a pretty good win. We outshot them by a big number. People have written us off and you proved them all wrong. Well done on a great result. Everybody be happy. I'm happy. You're happy. We're all happy. Let's be happy together. How about that? All right. So we're back up into the middle of the premiership. That's better. Uh, amazing what one win can do for you. But there you go. Early in the season. Let's see where we're going to come back for now. Um depends. If, if, if Greenock Morton should somehow knock off Celtic in the cup, then I'll come back for Celtic, for, for Greenock Morton and Rangers. But if they do not, I'll probably come back. How about we go with Dundee and St. Mirren? We haven't looked at either. Or Dundee United, that is. And, uh, and St. Mirren. We haven't seen either of those teams particularly, so I think that's when we'll come back. All right, so we're looking to come back for Dundee and St. Mirren. I hope you're having a good time. I hope you've enjoyed watching the video. If you have, maybe hit the like button. Hit subscribe if that's your thing. Follow me on Twitter. Support me on Patreon. Or don't. Whichever makes you happy. That's the key to all of this is, you know, making yourself happy. I'm happy doing this, so I hope you're happy watching it. I hope you're having a great day, and take care.